Beloved fathers, look after your children, look after your daughters. Don't ever abuse your children, no matter who they are, even the boys. Don't ever abuse them, even if it means verbal abuse. You know, people swear their own children, they curse their own children. Why? You are supposed to be praying for them, being patient with them, no matter what they've done. Keep praying, keep trying, keep being patient. You don't have to abuse them. Sometimes people torture their children with physical abuse and they try to use religion to actually justify that. Enough is enough. I think we definitely need to address this matter. That's why I'm speaking about it, but we need to address it more often. And many people need to speak about it. I really reach out to those who have been affected in this way. May the Almighty help you and, and guide you. You need to speak up to an elderly person, perhaps within the family. Another very big disease we have <clears throat> is that when this matter is raised with some family members, they brush it under the carpet or they think perhaps it's not true or they say, no, it's okay. Maybe you were misreading, misjudging. No, we're, we cannot be misjudging and misreading. It happened. And if it did happen, it's the duty of those who are told about it to do something about it. Because these children, what will happen to them? Sometimes as they grow older, they, they cannot bear those scars because they haven't healed. No one's actually helped them. So my brothers and sisters, I pray that we can, actually, uh, we can actually help our children. And this needs to go far and wide. I'm going to be posting it on YouTube today. And inshallah, I pray that we can benefit from it and, and spread the word. And like I say, if you are a father and you were guilty of doing something of this nature to your child, whether it's verbal abuse, physical abuse, sexual abuse, you know, uh, uh, mol molesting the child. <clears throat> Remember, the full wrath of the Almighty is on its way. It's on its way, definitely. And not only that, the wrath of the law of, will also be on its way. You need to seek forgiveness, repentance from the person you did it to, as well as from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. You need to make amends, help them heal. And you need to admit that you were totally wrong, unacceptably. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala forgive us all. May He open our doors, protect our children. May, may Allah safeguard.